in this tutorial we are going to work on a Morse code translator using Arduino Nano for this you will require any Arduino board here we are going to use Arduino Nano 33 IoT the documentation and forums related to the usage of this Arduino Nano would be pinned in the description below so moving on let's see what Morse code actually is Morse code is a method used in telecommunication to encode text in characters as standardized sequences where we use dots and dashes or dits or dash where here you can see each letter's Morse code and let's see its application so on this platform Morse code world where you can inscribe your text let's try inscribing our text let's say hello okay so now you can see S stands for four dots E stands for a, a single dot and respectively for others this can not only be represented in dots and dashes but also using sound and lights let's see the light one so this is how we encrypt the text into the Morse code let's automate this process so for that we are going to use nanos in built LED firstly let's see some properties of the Morse code the length of a dot is one unit a dash is three units the space between parts of the same letter is one unit the space between letters is three units and the space between the words is seven units here the Morse code for each letter and digits are shown so let's move to the coding part here I have declared unit which actually shows 500 milliseconds under the time to which is same as the unit 500 milliseconds let's see this function switch on which will switch on the inbuilt LED for some specified time as you can see here and it will also delay it with some fixed time around which is 500 milliseconds so let's see the loop part here as A represents dot and dash I have used the switch on to switch on the LED for one unit then switch it off and again switch on for three units so dot represents the one unit and dash represents the three units similarly I have done for the T I T Y A and totally it's Aditya which represents my name so this code is hard coded and not adaptive at all Alternatively, I have used another method using a loop. Here, I have declared a string, which is again Aditya. As we know, a string is an array of characters. So, in the loop part, I have declared a for loop, which will start from the first index of the string to the last index of the string, and it will call a function here in that function it matches each letter and calls the function switch on so basically I have hard coded the Morse code for each letter starting from A ending to the Z that's the end of the coding part all the code and the resources would be uploaded on the github repository which is pinned down in the description of this video the next clip would be remarking the working of this project.